Today's top stories. Syria's President Bashar al-Assad on Tuesday defended Iran's nuclear program during a one-day visit by President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad to Damascus. The Syrian leader criticized Western allegations that Iran was seeking a nuclear bomb, calling such claims purely, quote, political. He said, quote, those who suspect the presence of an Iranian military nuclear program should also show that they are concerned about the Israeli military nuclear program. Israel has not confirmed or denied suspicions that it has what arms control experts assume a sizable nuclear arsenal. Iran hanged eight convicted drug traffickers and another man found guilty of murder, press reports said on Wednesday. The drug traffickers, who were not identified, were hanged on Saturday in the northeastern town of Tayyabad, near the Afghan border. Another man, identified as Abdul Barit Nur Zehi, was executed in a prison in Kash, a town in the eastern province of Sistan Baluchistan. Meanwhile, the lawyer of the two juvenile offenders said today that Iran has ordered a stay of execution for the two. Amir Khaleki, 20, and Safar Anguti, 19, were due to be hanged this morning in Tehran's Evin prison. The two were convicted of committing murder at the ages of 16 and 17. The move came days after Iran sparked international outrage by executing another juvenile offender, Dilara Darabi, who was convicted of committing murder when she was 17. These stories and more at televisionwashington.com.